People watch as a suspect opens fire on officers, and officers fire back. Good afternoon. We are getting a better idea of what happened before and after a suspect got into a shootout with police last night. The suspect was shot dead in a busy area of town, and a lot of neighbors watched it unfold. News 13's Cole Miller is live at San Mateo and Constitution with new details. Cole. Well, Kim, police say this all started when they got a call to this area about a couple of suspicious guys. They caught one, another took off running, later shooting at police. Neighbors here caught the aftermath on video. It's the chaotic scene in the seconds following Albuquerque's latest police shooting. This video shot by a neighbor shows the aftermath and the response. Second male subject produced a firearm and shot at him at least twice. Police say they were responding to a report of two suspicious people near San Mateo and Constitution just before five yesterday. They nabbed one guy before the other took off running. They say that runner turned around and opened fire at officers. Leonard Jaramillo owns a nearby salon. I saw someone running down the street. Um, then I saw a series of police officers on a very high speed chase. That's when things took a turn. I saw him turn around, pull out a gun and start to shoot. Jaramillo hit the floor. At that point, um, I saw the police return fire. Elizabeth Galvez shares a very similar story. We saw a lot of police activity outside the front window. She says one police officer parked just outside of her home and then he got out of his car, drew his gun, walked down the alley and shot. My husband threw me to the ground away from the window and we heard another nine shots and it was all over within 30, 45 seconds. Neighbors say this is where it all ended in a dirt alleyway just to the east of San Mateo. And after that gunfire silenced, one suspect was dead. After that, it was just chaos. Police say that man was wearing body armor. A gun was recovered near his body. Two officers opened fire. No officers were injured. It was like being in an episode of CSI. We've heard a lot about the police shootings here in town, but when it's right in your front yard, it's really frightening. And while we were out here today, we spoke to one neighbor who says he found a small knife in that alleyway. He called police and they had actually told him that they had been looking for it. Detectives Kim later came and picked it up. Back to you. Okay, thank you, Cole. Now